Well, hello guys, and welcome back to another Riotech Corporation video. I'm Commander Corley, your host, and today we're back in Art of War 3 Global Conflict. Today's battle is going to be Commander Corley versus Pascal. A little bit of ground and a whole lot of air. So let's jump right on into the battle, shall we? Alright, it's going to be a confrontation battle type on the icy mountain map. Alright guys, so we've got our facilities coming up here. We're going to go ahead and start training some assaults. Gonna pop that boost there. Get as many of them out as we can as fast as we can. So that we can scout out all them wonderful containers. This. Gotta get them containers. The name of the game in this game is get them containers. So we found one there. There's just another one. So we've got three assaults out, searching for all them wonderful containers. We just keep grabbing them and grabbing them and grabbing them. So right now we're going up to level 2 HQ. Going to go ahead and put in an assault vehicle factory as well. Oh yeah. Get them containers. Upgrading to level 2 barracks. Looks like we've found us an enemy down south here. Alright, taking him out. Nice. Pop another scouting bonus. Make sure I don't miss any containers. Got one right there. Our scout's going to scout out his base. Complete miss from that grenade there. And that one as well. Looks like he's got a small base, couple, couple power stations. One, two, looks like he's working on three supplies, two barracks, construction yard, and an HQ right now. Right now, we're going to go ahead and go to level three barracks. We're at level two assaults, producing some hammers. Yeah get it out there got us another container spotted we grab it our first hammer coming out the door all right Little 1v1 battle going on down here. Looks like he's trying to get him in the salt factory up as well.
at this point I've got an aviation factory going up. Just gonna continue to scout everything out. that two hammers and a fortress now out got several assaults sitting there one sitting over here in the corner looks like yeah sitting there in the corner a tree all right all the fortresses are out Gonna get us a cyclone or two up. Gonna go ahead and go up to level 3 HQ. And gonna move out my assault vehicles. Put them right over here. On a patrol. There's my cyclone. Could have swore I had an enemy over here, so I sent him up there. Double check, didn't see anything, so You're good. Taking out the base again. Does have that assault factory? Three powers, three supply, two barracks. In and out, the cyclone will do a little bit of scouting at this point. And looks like HQ is good and ready to go. And there comes the airfield. And there goes the upgrade for the aviation factory to level two. At this point I'm out of power. Be a perfect time for him to strike because I have no power. Go ahead and pop a another gold boost for our supply. And throwing in a power station right there. Gonna get these guys on the patrol. Right now, Cyclone's just stationed over the village there, just in case they come up that way. Another power station going in. Couple heavy assaults here to add to the patrol. All right, we're ready for vertex. Ready for those vertexes. Got a hammer sitting up here for some strange reason. Vertex number one's coming out. Cyclone's still sitting over the village and now he's starting to move again. 
gonna go check out this black area here. See if there's any more supply creeks or anything that I've missed. Alright, gonna head south a little bit. And looky there, he's got a little army stationed up. And we don't want to lose our cyclone, so we're going to get him out of there because all of them the riflemen will take that cyclone out. But we do know that he's got a small army there. We've got our first bird takes up, ready to go. Patrols are looking good. him back up north get him out of their firing range pop another supply at this point I move my cyclone again scouting again just in case he's got anything moving which he doesn't send him all the way over to the edge of the map here all right while all that's going on, my last vertex will be coming out. Went ahead and put up a defensive building here and here. Got another hammer and then another fortress popped out as well. Gonna get that fortress and hammer on the patrol right here. At this point, I decide to move my cyclone some more, and I'm gonna use the edge of the map as cover as I move south. Looks like he's got himself an aviation factory, another supply station, another power grid, uh, power station. I'm gonna post up the cyclone right here in the corner, out of the range of any of the enemy. So I'm just searching right now as I send my vertex in to take out the power making sure you ain't got any more ba uh, buildings that I don't know of and it looks like we're good he's got no defensive buildings no defensive structures at all so we're just gonna knock out the power as fast as we can and with that his power is completely knocked out he cannot produce anything except for infantry I'm going to post the cyclone up right here and let him take out that bear while they refuel. Now I know he's still got that army right here, which has not moved thanks to the flyover from the vertexes. So where we're at right now, we're just waiting for them vertexes to refuel. Letting this cyclone have his way with that bear. Here they come again. Vertex strike again. Gonna take out that aviation factory. Yeah, 
Take out that barracks. And then the assault factory. Now we know he's still got this large army here. Vertexes have strike. Now all that's left is to finish off his base. Cyclone is attacking. So I'm grouping all of my vehicles and all of my infantry together here. Getting them ready for the charge. And there they head out. Time to completely knock out the base. And there the vertexes go again. At this point, I'm just trying to do as much damage as I can with the Vertex. Because they've all returned to base now. For a refuel again. Here's the confrontation on the ground. Horses. Go ahead and let my vertex attack. It's definitely a close battle. But my fortress has went out over top. All right. So now all that's left is to finish off the base. Here comes another vertex strike. Well done. get one pass but I've got what's left of my ground forces moving in and my friends that is the battle a little bit of ground a whole lot of air I hope y'all enjoyed this battle. This is Commander Corley. This is signing off. guys i want to uh go ahead and throw this out there uh, i want to appreciate you for watching my videos and at the same time i want to get the word out for uh, swifty saloon my buddy uh, he started up his own uh, business and he's making these wonderful looking figures and uh wonderful looking 
blocks for Dungeons and Dragons, I believe. Um, many different creatures, many different out of ground top areas. You got your dice, um, all kinds of little odds and ends. You need to check him out. Swifty Saloon on Facebook. And uh, hit him up and tell him that I sent you there. He might even throw you a discount. Again, thanks for watching, and as always, this is Jonathan with the Riotic Corporation. Until next time.